Now, if we switch switch three to the left, our green light comes on. If we switch it to the right, our green light does not come on, but we have our auto. If we touch our two wires together, that is gonna let us remotely operate this. But now with both wires touched, we'll switch switch three back to the center and that's off. <laughs> on this circuit, one of our contacts is gonna be wired directly to 24 volt to energize our green light. And the other one is gonna go through some type of auxiliary contact. Now, the first thing we have to figure out is which contact is which on the switch. Are you talking about normally closed or normally open? And that's a great question on this, because on our buttons, we did have normally open, normally closed on each one of them. But over here on switch three and switch four, there's actually two normally open contacts. And depending on which way you switch it is which one switches. And here's the trick to this is it's not necessarily you switch this to the left and the left contact moves which it did there, but check it out on this one. Now, if I switch this one to the left, the right contact actually moves. Let's take a wire from the plus 24 volt to hand. And then on the bottom, let's jump our both contacts and take it to our green light. And then take a wire from the green light to the minus. Take a wire from the plus 24 volt, and I'm gonna switch switch three to the left so we can make sure which contact's moving. And so we're gonna take it into the top of the right contact. Now I'll take two wires underneath the other side of the hand contact and take one of those wires to the bottom of the auto contact. And this is our jumper. That's right. And take the other wire to one side of the green light. And it does not matter. That's a great question. Let's save that to the end of the video. Okay. And then take a wire from the other side of the green light and take it to the minus terminal blocks, or the right side of terminal blocks. Now to simulate what we would have an auto, let's put a wire into the top of the auto terminal. And we're going to take a wire to the plus 24 volts. Now if we switch switch three to the left, our green light comes on. If we switch it to the right, our green light does not come on. But we have our auto. If we touch our two wires together, that is going to let us remotely operate this. But now with both wires touched, we'll switch switch three back to the center, and that's off. Amber, you brought up a really good question I sidelined you on it about whether polarity mattered. And on this particular light, it does not. But on this relay, it does. So click here where we're going to learn about polarized relays.